bed. in the bed. So we got a call for a truck and I think a trailer that's stuck in the mud up on Smith's Mesa. We're gonna head up there, see if we can get it out. It's a beautiful morning, probably 60 degrees, no clouds in the sky. It's gonna be a pretty day. It's the weekend, so the weekend crew is responding to this job. Here we are. This is one of the prettiest places in the world, in my opinion. The camera's not gonna show up. You got Pine Valley Mountain right there. You've got Co-op Fingers right there. Zion National Park out there. This is a beautiful drive. Yeah, it is. You can kinda see a bit of everything over here. You got snow on one side and giant red rock on the other. Okay, we're getting close. We probably should have come in from the Kolob Terrace Road. It would have been a little bit shorter, but we got to do the whole loop, so that's fun. I've never driven all the way through before. Beautiful drive today. Oh, I think that might be them right here. Here we go. Your destination is on the right. No. Well, in there. he's not stuck, but this is probably just who we're meeting. Yeah. How's it going? Good. You the one nice we're looking for? Today. All right, there it is, out there. Is that it? It's in the field here. Looks stuck. So this was probably a real mess a day or two ago, but it dries out quick. The ground has good drainage. The desert air is arid. <laughs> so let's go see what we got here. This doesn't look too bad. It looks like we can just pop it out, move a little bit to the side, angle in, and get it hooked up to this trailer. It's not that bad. How long you been up here? Uh, well, I've been stuck for two days. <laughs> oh, have you? Yeah. But my buddy finally came up. We tried pulling it out, but we broke a couple straps. Oh. You got your knife on you? I do. So, are you, are you going to be hooking up to this today? No. I, okay, I'm, you just need to get out. I'm going to have him hook up to it. Okay. All right. All right. Well, this truck doesn't have any recovery hooks. So no, we, that cross section. Uh, so we're going to take a soft shackle, put it right around there. It's not going to take much to get this out. You want it in drive or you want it in neutral? Got the, the keys in it? Yeah. Hey little pooch. Hey little pooch. We're not going very fast no, or very no. far. shirt do you want yeah there you go thank you well, awesome good to meet you yeah it was Thanks. good to meet you guys so it got stuck a few days ago they just need it out of the way it's dried out enough that it's not going to be hard to get hooked up and uh, get that trailer pulled out of there when they're ready to but yeah that went super easy barely an inconvenience yeah just one hit and it popped right out so this was really just a nice beautiful drive so we got a call for a Jeep Cherokee that is broke down out in the Bear Claw Poppy area, Bloomington Caves area, out there, way out there. Unfortunately, I am busy working on this. I can't tear myself away from it. And neither can Tom. But fortunately, we have Jake and Colby. 
I'm gonna send them out there in blue steel in the trailer. They're gonna scoop it up and get the job done. We do get a lot of questions about how jobs come in. So this particular call came through AAA. They're way out there. They gave us a call to see if we can go out there and get it. We can. We're gonna send these guys. Get after it. We'll get it. We'll get it. So Matt sent us on this mission, but before we left, we checked the winch. The winch wasn't working. So we had to call Matt over here. Yes, I think we. I think this winch is fried. It's had a long, hard, horrible little life. Do we have any color on? I think it's good. Let's increase your odds of accomplishing this task. So now we have a new, new jack swing here. Remember, black is in the back. Black is in the back. Red is by the bed. Red is by the bed. So here's the deal. I'm setting my team up to fail again with some sketchy equipment that we haven't upgraded. I have a brand new Apex winch to put on this. Love the Apex winch. They are very quality product. We have not installed on this yet. Because why? Because we're lazy. <laughs> All right, I gotta go build a derby car. You guys need to get in your way. Thank you. Call the gentleman, let him know you're coming. Yes, sir. Just let him know you're in route. Let's do this. Let's do it. This is my first time driving Blue Steel Tona trailer on a job specifically, and it's honestly pretty exciting. But I'm gonna switch over the reins to the real truck driver. Welcome back. Hey, sir. how's it going? I'm back. You guys ready to go get this recovery done? I'm ready. Is this really a road? The customer told us that a passenger hopped out and started walking to find help. We have 38 minutes on this dirt road. Let's place a bet on when you think we're gonna find him and pick him up. What are you going for? 12 minutes. I well, bet he's 12 minutes up this road. Okay, so Jake says 12 minutes. I'm gonna say 25. 25 minutes. When this timer gets down to 26 minutes, Jake wins. When the timer gets down to 13 minutes, I win. What do we got rolling on this? I'll bet you a Lynn's lunch. We're on. We just crossed over Jake's time limit. See ah. we'll, we'll see how close we get in between he and I's time. <laughs> we'll find out. I'm starting to feel like he's owing me some Lynn's lunch. I might. Colby, you win this one. We found the guy. There he is right up there up on the trail. I don't know if you can see him. He's right there. Howdy. Are you the one with the uh, Jeep Cherokee? He's up there. All right, you want to hop in? I'd love to. How long you been walking? Uh, two hours. Yeah? We came out for a walk and I got a walk. Yeah, all right. We're about 17 minutes up from the pen over here in this Jeep Cherokee. So we almost forgot to do the weather report. It's about 64 degrees. It's sunny, there's a few clouds in the sky, but it's a great day. I see a Jeep. So we made it over here and we met Henry. He's been waiting for us. Ed was down the trail about four miles, about a two hour hike. I think we're gonna back this trailer in, channel our inner mat, winch him up on the trailer and get out. Beautiful. So what happened to you? Well, we parked it and went for a hike, came back, had lunch, then we wanted to go for a different hike, tried to start it up. She's a no start. No start. No start. No it start. cranked, cranked and cranked and nothing. Black is in the bed, red is in the bed. All right. Look at this awesome setup. Red towards the bed, black towards the back. We got to get this thing upgraded, Matt. That was actually really easy. That wasn't bad. Thanks for letting us do this, Matt. I know you're busy. All right, so now we got this bad boy loaded up and now we gotta go drop it off. I know you guys are usually used to seeing Matt over here. Who's this new guy? I usually do the on-road recoveries for Matt with his rollbacks. This is my first off-road recovery. It was a blast.
All right, we just made it to our destination. We're gonna unload this rig and uh, get these guys set on their way. All right, so we went and got Henry and Ed. Thank you guys for letting us uh, come out and get you guys. You know, hey. that, was, that was great fun uh, for Colby and I. We don't really get to do this that often by ourselves, so really appreciate it. You saved us a night in the wilderness without <laughs> yeah. any camping gear. Yeah. Okay, thanks a lot, guys. Thanks for watching. Thank you, Jake. Sweet taste of victory. Deal's a deal.